Saturday, 12.30 kickoff, Everton hosts Liverpool in the infamous Merseyside derby. Form goes out the window when you're looking at a derby like this, so don't jump to conclusions that this is an easy Liverpool win. Everton have a good home record under Allardyce, winning five of the last nine home games and only losing to United and City in that time. It's also worth noting Liverpool will have minimal recovery time after playing City in the Champions League on Wednesday evening and may rest some key players. I don't see any clean sheets come Saturday lunchtime. Everton have seen both teams to score in four of the last six games, whilst Liverpool have in three of the last six. It's an extremely tough one to call, but I think there's value in both teams getting on the score sheet, so my tip is both teams to score. Huddersfield make the trip to the Amex to take on Brighton, as both teams battle it out in the hope to end winless streaks and distance themselves from the relegation zone. Unfortunately for the Terriers, their away record in this debut Premier League campaign isn't something to be proud of. They've been defeated in five of their last six away league games and have managed just ten away goals all season. Moreover, Huddersfield have failed to score in seven of their last nine matches in the Premier League. Brighton, meanwhile, have won three of their last four home games and have only lost four times in the league at the Amex Stadium all season. No team outside the top six has lost fewer home games than Brighton this campaign. And with Huddersfield's away record so poor, we think Brighton will claim the win here. I'm going for a correct score prediction of 2-0. Watford take on Burnley, 3 o'clock Saturday. Both teams in very good form. Watford have won 11 points from their last five home games. Burnley have won their last three, but Watford have conceded a league high 27 goals in the opening 45 minutes. So my tip here, slightly rogue, Burnley half time, draw full time. Leicester host Newcastle on Saturday at 3 p.m. Leicester are undefeated in their last six home matches and Jamie Vardy has scored in eight of his last 10 matches for Leicester in all competitions. Away from home, Newcastle have won just three Premier League games all season. All of those wins were against sides currently in the bottom seven. Swansea, West Ham and Stoke. I think Vardy's going to keep up his good scoring record, so for me, the tip is Vardy any time. Rockboss and West Brom host Swansea and the Baggies will be searching for their first win in nine. They most certainly have had a season to forget this time out. They've only won three games all season and have pretty much cemented their place in the Championship after an abysmal 2018. And when you thought it couldn't get any worse for them, Alan Pardew exiting this week means they'll be entering this fixture with even less confidence than usual. Swansea, on the other hand, have had a solid couple of months since the appointment of Carvajal. They've been defeated just three times in their previous ten games in the Premier League. But Swansea's away form isn't something we should be forgetting. They've failed to win 13 of their last 14 league matches on the road. So the form book would suggest a defeat here. But that said, West Brom's form on home soil has been equally tragic in recent weeks. So I'd say under 2.5 goals doesn't look a bad shout. Bournemouth take on Crystal Palace at 3 o'clock on Saturday. Bournemouth have both scored and conceded in 12 of their last 13 games, including each of the last seven in a row. Crystal Palace have won just five points from their last 27 available, but recently they've played Tottenham, United, Chelsea and Liverpool all within their last five games, and they were unlucky to lose to each of them. So I think this game will be close. I think there's goals, both teams to score. Saturday, 3pm, Stoke hosts Spurs. Stoke are in terrible form at the moment and have lost their last three matches, while Spurs, on the other hand, have won their last five. To add to the Potters' misery, it looks like Spurs have a bit of a routine in beating Stoke. The last four times they've met, Spurs have won by a four-goal margin. Unfortunately for Stoke, I can't see this going any other way. Therefore, my tip is Spurs half-time, Spurs full-time. The late kickoff on Saturday is the Manchester derby as Man City hosts Man United. Man City will be resting players ahead of the Champions League quarter-final, no doubt, but they're unbeaten in their last 27 home league games. Man United are unbeaten in their last two league visits to the Etihad and have kept a clean sheet each time. I think this one's going to be tight, so I'm going for a draw. <laughs> 